Column, I, I've been in this house maybe once ever before, but it seems like a treasure trove of art and sculpture and everything else. Could you tell us a bit about the house? Well, a lot of the houses along here were built for the British Army and populated by the likes of my family thereafter. My grandfather was Joseph Higgins. He was a sculptor, and some of his work here behind me. He died young, but he was a great talent. And my father was Seamus Murphy, who was a sculptor, so there's a couple of generations of stuff there. There's art everywhere. It's, it's amazing. I've never been in a house with, with, with such a variety of art and such a, well, and the amount of it. Well, nice of you to say. For me, there's connections with everything there. I'm just very blessed, really, to be in the middle of it all, really. For a long time, I just knew you as a musician, a baron player, but I ne never knew that, that you were an artist as well. I'm delighted that you're calling me a, a musician. As a baron player, you spent 30 years telling me that I wasn't, wouldn't I? <laughs> because I'm a boron player, but era, you I'm know, I'm getting gentle with old age. I, geez, that'll be the day, all right. <laughs> <laughs> so we spent a good few years playing with Ted Allen, too. I did, I did, yeah. A good, good couple, I suppose, closing on 20. Um, yeah, toured the world. It was great, great fun. Great, I'm very privileged to have been in that company now. I always wondered what goes through the mind of a bar on player when they're playing. Nothing at all. It's like it's like Homer Simpson thinking of pork chops. Like <laughs> nothing at all. I can guarantee you that's that's the only answer to that. Nothing. What would you think? <laughs>